world's largest pump and treat system is officially green. The system will help clean contaminated groundwater. Among some of the recycled materials used to build the structure were 420 tons of recycled concrete and 42 tons of recycled metal. Workers on this project are proud of this great accomplishment. Everything you see, the structural steel, right down to the skins of the buildings, is recycled. The main process building for the system has achieved gold certification from the U.S. Green Building Council's leadership for energy and environmental design, known as LEED. This is a first in the DOE environment management complex. LEED is an internationally recognized green building certification system that rates buildings on criteria such as energy savings, water efficiency, and CO2 emissions. It took about two years with nearly around-the-clock work to complete this project, and at the peak there were over 400 employees working here. Project Vice President Kent Doris says the safe work hours can't go unnoticed. Workers work safely over a million hours. The project performance is outstanding from our point with safety. We've achieved our million hours of safe work hours without a days away, which is a big deal for us, a big deal for everybody. The pump and treat system has been built to treat contaminants in the groundwater on the Hanford site. The goal of protecting the Columbia, where we and the community that we reside in, is number one for us. It's been very great to be able to go home every day and tell my daughter that we are working every day to protect our future. Now that construction is complete, operations are expected to start mid-summer.